Hi, it's Stephen Lage from the Lage Team at Coldwell Banker, and today I'm going to be discussing our predictions for what to expect in the real estate market in 2019. Before we get into what to expect in 2019, let's see where we were in 2018. Uh, now, 2018 was another steady year in the real estate market. Uh, we saw consistent sales. Uh, overall, inventory was still lower in comparison to uh, buyer demand. Uh, but as far as sales and average sales prices, those were pretty steady uh, from the year prior. Uh, one of the big things we did see towards the very tail end of 2018 is we did see a drop in interest rates. Uh, now, this was mostly due to uh, market conditions in the stock market and the uh, investment markets uh, uncertainty and of course the government shutdown and due to that uncertainty in the markets uh, the interest rates have come down they're probably down close to half a percent than they were at the peak in the, at the end of 2018 um, and because of that dip down in the interest rates there's been an increase in the demand over December and January so to the point where in December and January, we both we saw more homes going under contract than coming on the market. Uh, now this hasn't happened in years. So this is a, a very drastic change. So the, the demand or the, the buyer demand increased drastically because people that had been looking for homes or were on the fence uh, might have been discouraged that rates had gone up the last couple year to two years. Uh, and now with that de decrease in interest rates, they're out there buying. So there's a lot of buyers out there right now, which has drastically increased the demand uh, for inventory, which is still very, very low. So people that are putting their homes on the market right now are seeing um, great results and we're getting homes under contract right away. Uh, the average days on market, even in 2018, dipped down from the year prior. So it, it was still uh, an advantage to sellers in 2018 where, where they were selling their home quicker, uh, although the prices uh, were, were right around the same as uh, the year prior. Because of the government shutdown being over and uh, stock market somewhat stabilizing or starting to stabilize, we do expect those rates to uh, increase, uh, to get back to the level they were before and beyond. So most economists when asked say, predict that interest rates will increase this year. So that will, uh, that will mean that uh, if you're a buyer in this market, you, know, you might want to start looking now um, and not wait for the spring market to, to get the best rate possible this year. And for sellers, it means that uh, if those buyers are out there now, you, know, you might want to think about putting your home on the market now and also not waiting for the spring market. Um, uh, again, most economists, when asked, they believe that the real estate market is going to see increases. So they, they expect increases in values this year. Um, over 94% of economists uh, polled say the same thing, that uh, we will see increases in values and increases in sales this year. Also when polled, most Americans still feel that real estate is a great investment, over 65% of people asked think that real estate is a great investment still uh, and that begin that continues to increase uh, as we get farther and farther beyond you know the recession that we had and the downturn in the market which obviously affected a lot of people and as we continue to build in the real estate market more and more people feel that it's it's stable long term and that it is a good investment um, so as far as expectations for 2019, we, we expect it to be another steady year. As I said, rates will increase, um, but that will continue to drive buyers to get out into the market and buy homes. Um, so we, we will see a, st a steady year as far as sales, uh, probably consistent to what we've seen the last couple of years. Home values might, might increase slightly, uh, but what I do feel is that the days on market will continue to go down. So for the sellers who do decide to sell this year, uh, you, might, you might see uh, lower sales times and uh, an increase in uh, how quickly you are able to sell your home. So that's our predictions for the 2019 real estate market. If you have any specific questions or would like to sit down and discuss your real estate needs, whether you're looking to sell or buy, please let us know. We'd be glad to meet with you. Until then, have a great day and hope to talk to you soon.